Uh, we're very fortunate to get out of it with a series win and head back, head back home in front of our fans and try and try and get another series win. Brandon, well, again, congrats on the win. But I want to know, are, how tired are you right now being that you were squatting and being behind the plate? You got to be exhausted, bud. I'm exhausted. <laughs> I'm exhausted. Yeah, I saw when they asked the trivia when they asked the trivia question yesterday, the hottest first pitch temperature in Target Field history, and then I looked at the weather today. I knew it was going to be a tough one, and then ended up being a four-hour and 31-run game. So, uh, got to enjoy this flight back uh, back home and and get a good night's sleep and uh, get ready to go back to work tomorrow. But um, you know, great team effort all around to to get this win and get the series win. I don't want to make you feel worse, but Matt Shepard just mentioned there were 401 pitches thrown in this game. At what point during the game are you saying to yourself, come on, we've got to move it along a little bit more quickly than this? <laughs> Was it 401 for both teams? For both for teams. Both yeah. teams. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it only felt like you got 401. Teams, yeah. 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 Yeah, it was a, you know, it was a long game. Um, there's, there's going to be games like this. Our, our pitching staff has been phenomenal all year, and um, there's, there's going to be weird days throughout a 162-game season, and today happened to be one of those weird days where, uh, where both offenses swung the bat well and um, felt like every, every time a pitcher for both teams threw one up there, was a, a good swing was put on it. And, um, you know, I, like I said, i got to do a better job calling pitches and, and doing a job behind the plate, and um, that's, I'm excited to get back to work to, to work on getting better at that. And Granny, speaking of swings, uh, you had a chance to go back down to Toledo. Uh, what were some of the things you worked on from an offensive standpoint? Because you had some good at swing, good swings, good at bats today. It's kind of choppy hearing you. I think I kind of got the gist of your question. Um, yeah, the, the main thing when I went back down to Toledo was to get healthy with my hamstring. And once I did that, uh, it was just trying to play good baseball and um, you know, when opportunity knocks, trying to make the most of it. And uh, unfortunately for Jake, he, he got injured and um, you know, I, I, I hate that for him. He was having such a good year and uh, helping the team win. So, uh, but you know, when, when he went down, I knew uh, I had to come up and do my best to help the team win every day. I, I'm in there, so uh, that's kind of my mindset each and every day: is um, have consistent quality at bats and, and try to do my job behind the plate to help put the put the team in a position to win. I'm going to guess there's a cold shower in your future. Thanks for hanging with us. We appreciate it. Uh, congratulations. Enjoy this one with your teammates. Thank you, guys. I appreciate you having me All on. Right.